up? It's Martin Garrix and you're watching Uncut Miami. How are you? Have you been, yeah, good. <laughs> nice. Good. How are you? I'm, I'm great. How have you been since I saw you two years ago? Was it two years ago? One and a half. One and a half. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm good. I've been in, uh, touring a lot, being at home a lot, working on music, Yeah. chilling with friends and family. Uh, a lot of fun. Yeah. You seem happy. I'm always happy. Yeah? Are you mainly happy because this, tonight this is all yours? <laughs> I'm nervous. Are you actually nervous? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah? Yeah, but in a good way. It's, yeah. not, it's not bad nerves. Why, why, why do you think? Because you've played on the main stage here before. And you were the youngest person ever to play on the main stage. And now you're headlining the main stage. And you're the youngest person ever to headline the main stage. It's making me nervous. Is it? <laughs> yeah. But also, uh, we're going to play a lot of new music. Yeah? So, uh, we're going to premiere an entire new show. So it's, of course, but it's... I'm nervous, but I'm also super excited. When people are watching this, they will have already seen, they will have already watched the live stream, nice. or they'll have watched your set. So they'll already be like, yeah, it was amazing, it was amazing. Nice. But why are you nervous about it? Is it because, it, like, is there, is, are you taking the sound anywhere that you maybe haven't taken it before? Yeah, definitely. It's, uh, I've had two months in the studio, um, and I just finished building my studio in Amsterdam. Uh, so I've, I've been working there, but also not only on the, electronic dance music. I've been trying to produce hip-hop influenced stuff. Uh, awesome. I've, I've been making weird, weird shit and I'm I'm gonna play the weird You're shit. You're gonna play some yeah, weird yeah. shit? Yeah. That's so, very, very yeah. cool. That's very cool. Yeah. So you've been playing weird shit to a crowd of like 30,000 people? Yeah. Good. Basically, yes. That's what I'm a little bit nervous for, but I, I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. Definitely, definitely. So since I've seen you, you've set up a label, Stamped Records. Yes. Now, on the car on the way here, I was talking to somebody who said that you've called it Stamped Records because your, your dad collects <laughs> stamps. Is that actually true? Yeah. My dad, uh, it's funny because my mom is a doctor and my dad, like they both didn't do anything in the music world and my dad has an auctioning company specialized in stamps. Um, but he helps me a lot like financial wise yeah, and yeah, running yeah. the company because Martin Garrix is like, I'm the DJ producer and the guy behind the interviews, but there's an entire team and he, He's super involved You're with everything. You're a brand, mate. Yeah, so I, I was like, I'm going to give a shout out to my dad and call, yeah. call Stamped Records. That's awesome. Yeah. And are you into stamp collecting yourself? I used to be. Really? Yeah, I used to be, but then I... Uh, There's a lot of money in it, man. There's a lot of money in it. Maybe if this DJing stuff doesn't work out, you could just become I, a stamp I don't know. collector. It, it's going down, though, uh, the stamps. Oh, is it? Yeah, because it's, like, it's more uh, older people collecting yeah. it. And but also, I think your DJ career is probably all right. It's going well. You, you, yeah, it seems, that seems to be going up. So, it's, this is, compared to the snakes and stuff, this game is shit. Cool. But it's quite fun. And we're going to make it look good in the edit. So what we'll do is, so I'm going to name some DJ. Basically, the game is this, right? Everybody, not a lot of people know this, but every human is descended from a different animal. People think that actually we're all descended from apes, but not many people actually look like they were descended from apes. For instance, I was probably descended from some kind of a monkey or a rat. <laughs> okay. No, no, no. <laughs> no, rats are great, man. You know, they survive. They're tough. That's true. Yeah, so we were playing a game where I'll tell you some... So text my girlfriend on the screen. Is that the game? Yeah, exactly. Let's text my girlfriend. Um, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll give you some artists, right? And I want you to tell me which animals they are actually descended from. Cool. Okay? Yes. And then we'll have a picture of them up on the screen in the video and we'll swap their face with that animal. Yeah. It'll be fucking hilarious. Cool. Okay. Avicii. What animal is Vici is Avicii in real life? It's like a Pokemon. Kind of, <laughs> almost. Yeah, a Pokemon. Yeah, that's yeah, good. Yeah, that's the, yeah okay. You could be a fictional creature. That's cool. perfect. Amazing. Um, what about David Guetta? What um, about Big David? Do you chat to David a lot? Yeah, a lot. Is, is he like a bit of a mentor? Yeah, definitely. He, he, he helps me with a lot of things, like advice-wise, music-wise, and yeah. stuff. He's like, oh, you should change this, or he's like, oh, I played this live, it was very really? nice. Really? That's awesome. But which animal uh, David be? I'm bad in this game. There's no he, right He has wrong. long hair, he's so... Long hair. And he's quite wise. Um, I think Dave, Dave's a lion. The long hair. Yeah, mate. 
definitely, definitely. Um, okay, last one then. Disclosure. The Disclosure boys. Because they said that you look like a really cute little bear. <laughs> And they were like thinking they'd like to give you a little. I think they're cute bears too. Really? You yeah, could be really all cute bears together. That's amazing. Uh, Afrojack, it's a giraffe. Afrojack's a giraffe. Yes. You're absolutely right. Um, so, dude, as a final thing, maybe we should just take take in some of the atmosphere cool. for a bit. Thanks very much for talking to me. Thanks Let's just so soak it all up. We're just going to soak it up. Just. See you, mate. That's for you. <laughs> Perfect. Thanks, Good luck, man.